I failed in every area of my life before Christ. I failed in marriages. I failed in my relationships with my family. I failed in my parenting. I failed in my religion. I mean, I failed in businesses. Just failing one after another before Jesus Christ. And I came to a place, I started hearing voices in my head. I call them tormenting spirits. Life is not worth living, a voice said. You are not good enough for this life. There is no hope for you. And I keep listening and listening and listening to those voices. Faith comes through hearing, hearing the word of God. But I want to tell you something. Faith comes through hearing, period. Watch what you hear. Watch, watch who you listen. Because sooner or later, what you hear and listen becomes a faith in you. And it is not necessarily God's word. Imagine first 28 years of my life, I was steadily fed with lies and deception. I believe I was not good enough. I believe I was a failure. I believe I was a loser. I believe I was fat. I was ugly. I was stupid. I believe always something was wrong with me when things went wrong because God hated me. I believed God was out there to get me. I mean, there are people right now listening to me and you think that God is mad at you and he's out there to get you. And then some people say God is not angry at you. Now, I'm not going to say that I don't know God's thoughts towards you or what you are doing at this very moment. He can be angry. I mean, we, we turn God in the Western world into a maid that he has to obey us. We don't have to obey him. So I'm not going to say he's not mad at you or you are not doing something wrong. But I, all I am saying is you can reconcile to him. And it's so easy to reconcile to God than human beings, than people. He takes your asking forgiveness. He takes your repentance right away. And he gives you a clean start. So if there's anything you want to name this, this is my clean start. 